to the offense that started to come back online in recent weeks is the running game. Senior running back Darius Hoggins, our own Mike Carter, caught up with Hoggins this week as he continues to get back up to speed. Before the start of the season, the Cajuns running attack appeared to be clear with fifth year senior Darius Hoggins, who backed up former Cajun and current New York Jets running back Elijah McGuire last year as the heir apparent at running back. But a funny thing happened on the way to his dorm room. Hoggins tripped and fell while going up a flight of stairs. The reason? Snapchat. <laughs> I wasn't snapping, I was licking that snap. I had food in my hand, a phone right here. And I... <laughs> Hoggins, who wears braces, broke his jaw from the fall, requiring him to sit out the first two games of the season. I, I didn't have any teeth knocked out. Uh, I, I, I didn't have any of my teeth, thanks to my braces, you know. You know, it would have been, been cool to have him, but I think it was good for those other backs to kind of get that. They were able to progress a little bit faster. Upon his return, Hoggins saw only limited work at running back until teammate Elijah Mitchell went down with a foot injury at Idaho, opening the door for Hoggins to step in. The injury to Elijah, that was, uh, that was heartbreaking because he was doing so good, but... Uh, but yes, I, I must say that those reps, those, those reps did give me back up speed. With Mitchell now out for the year following foot surgery, Hoggins will be asked to split time with sophomore Jordan Wright and Sunbelt standout this season, Trey Regis. As for that Snapchat? Well, that's the thing. I, I don't remember what I was looking at, but it was very interesting. <laughs> Hoggins said this week that while he, Regis, and Wright all share different abilities at running back, the biggest thing he's learned over the last three months is that your best ability is availability. At Cajun Field, Mike Carter, KATC Sports. Oh, lesson there. Watch.